Hi everyone, I'm going to read you guys a book today and it is called A Couch for Llama. And the author of this book is Leah Gilbert. A Couch for Llama. Hmm, look at all those llamas on the couch. <laughs> a Couch for Llama. <coughs> The Lagos family couch was very well loved. It was the perfect spot for snuggling and reading, card playing, fort building, and hiding and seeking. They had many good times together. Uh, maybe a few too many good times. Whee! Whoops! Something got spilled on the couch. And hey! Yikes, it's a dirty couch. So one day, they realized it was time for a new couch. So, they piled into the family car and off they went to find one. One that wasn't too big, more too small, but just right. The Lago family found the perfect couch. But on the way home, something went wrong. Whoosh! Llama found a couch. Snip. <laughs> And Llama brayed, hello, to the couch. Mm, but the couch didn't say anything. Llama tried to share his lunch, but the couch didn't seem to have an appetite. So Llama ate the couch instead. It tasted worse than a dry, dusty tumbleweed. The couch was useless. Take it away, he says. But it just, it just wouldn't budge. The Lago family noticed something was missing. Oh no, where's the couch? Meanwhile, Llama decided to just ignore the couch and pretend it wasn't there. This got very, very boring. And so Llama snuck up and pounced and bouncy bounce bounced and he whirled and he twirled and he jumped and he bumped. and fell down into the smushy, mushy, fluffy, poofy cushions. He actually finally completely loved the couch. The Lago family found their couch and also a llama. He's so comfy on his couch. a stubborn, couch-loving kind of a llama. They had a great idea. Don't worry, llama. We'll be right back. <gasps> what a surprise! A couch just for llama. At the end of the day, the Lago family was happy with their new couch. But Llama was happiest of all. Night, night, Llama. Now look at all the llamas. Okay, guys, I hope you liked this book, A Couch for Llama, and I hope you guys have a good rest of your day, and I'll see you later. Bye.